what, what is the code sign if you need something? I'll be sitting right here. We figured it'd be this. <laughs> you like city student government, speak up or pay up. Tonight, we'll be hearing from members of Virginia's House of Delegates as we discuss Virginia's state budget and learn how to impact higher education and tuition at Mason. Unfortunately, the one thing that I am very sure of is that George Mason, in its relatively new history, along with uh, Old Dominion, as I understand it, are the two universities uh, within the Virginia system that are not properly at benchmark. Worse than this year, uh, we're going to lose the stimulus money, and for George Mason alone, that's about $20 million. Uh, what we can do to hold tuition down uh, the governor has a um, significant work group looking at it, made up of a lot of business people, college presidents from all around the Commonwealth looking at a whole bunch of things. Uh, jurisdictional boundary lines. But we also have to ensure that we, we have certain majority minority districts in Virginia, both at the House of Delegates and at the... I, I know all that. That's, that's, this that's, that's understood. Everybody here may not. I, I don't know if the public viewing fits in there. You can look on the website right now and find that like, my district is almost double the, the size that it should be. That's because your district was enlarged uh, 10 years ago. Excuse me, no. um, I would just like the delegates to answer the question. Sure. So just let them answer. It wasn't right, large. You. Every district had this roughly the same number of people. I would were definitely there. say it turned out better than we could imagine. Like, I mean, look at all these students that just came out. Like, usually, you know, people are in class at this time, and it's definitely one of the best turnouts we've had for a student government event on a Tuesday night. And I'm very proud of what student government has done with this event. And this is, we're strongly hoping to engage in more lobbying efforts with the General Assembly come February, and we feel this is a wonderful stepping stone in that direction. Uh, I think the event went really well. It was really nice to have the delegates come to their school, talk to us about the sort of the background behind the budget, where the money goes, the decision that goes into deciding where the money goes, and also what we can do as students get more involved and to increase the budget and get more money for George Mason. The students not only conveyed the personal importance of the the, the financial strain of trying to complete uh, a degree uh, under today's economic circumstances. But also I thought there was a, a very high level of um, I'll use the word intelligence, but that there weren't simple answers, that all of this uh, had many elements to it that needed to be addressed, and, and they were really digging in to, to figure out how to be most effective and what to be looking at. Very, very first ran for office. My kickoff was here on the George Mason campus when it was probably oh, oh, five percent of the size it is now. I mean, there was there was the building where I kicked it off has already been torn down. It's an old building. So.